Jack Rolls for both players this game have not been overly impressive in general. Feast and famine in a lot of ways. When they hit, they hit really well. When they don't, when they just need average rolls to hit, they kind of flub out. Trying to, looks like he's trying to figure out a way to get Xerxes in to finish off that, that Reckoner. Xerxes certainly the other man to do it at this point. Yep, yep. But he does need to clear that errant. See the Arc Carreri. It looks like going next. Charging the choir to clear them out. I don't know if I would want to commit Xerxes at this point in the game to killing the Reckoner. Perhaps better to just really double down on the far flag. Just get the whole army over there and blocking more uh, protectorate troops from getting to that position. And then just take it next turn, like you said. Yeah, there's it's a safe bet. There's no rush for Martin at this point. Being up 4-0 is huge. And really, the Reckoners... The Reckoner and the Redeemers, to a lesser extent, are the last big hitters in Mike's army. And we've seen that the Redeemers struggle against those shield-walled cataphracts. <coughs> so we see the leader model for the choir dying to an Arcari charge. So Re Reckoner has 24 points left on it. Martin. Trying to determine exactly how he wants to proceed now. He's eliminated a few choir members. Taking a careful look at that table. The thing too is he has he still has that fully health gladiator that's just been hanging out in the back the entire time. <laughs> yeah. He's still way back there. So even if the even if the Reckoner manages to take out Tiberian next turn. If he positions that gladiator properly, the gladiator can just come in and wreck the Redeemer itself, or the Reckoner, excuse me. As this turn goes on and the more that happens, I really think you want to just double down on yep. that far flag. Yeah, the all of the head, there's no real heavy hitters over there. The Harbinger would, you've got a Redeemer, you've got some errant, or, exempt, or zealous, excuse me, that are very squishy once their their ability goes. And if you can kill Tristan, that means that Redeemer is not going to be able to contest the flag. So we see the Cataphracts now going. Vorkesh going up, advancing five, trying to get within melee range for some attacks. They are doing the shield wall order again, keeping them to be a solid brick in front of Xerxes. So Vorkesh making an attack against the errant officer. Does hit. Kills him. Martyrdom. Two points. See another attack on the errant. Hits. Kills. Martyrdom. Two more damage. We see a combined we see a command check being forced on the choir. The Reclaimer solo has plenty of souls again. So choir does pass, though. They're OK with it. Two combined man attack oh, on Tristan. Oh, combined attack on Tristan whiffs. So we see another choir member get hit. Hits and kills the choir leader. So stripping out those choir, only one left. So we see a, a, an incendiary actually deciding to shoot. <laughs> uh, shooting at the Reclaimer. So it deviates four inches one. So it sets the Redeemer on fire. Thanks to awe and uh, the concealment bonus from the woods. See another, the other incendiary movement, unit moving up. Trying to set the zealots on yep. fire. Can't kill them right now, but they can 
make them burn. First one hits. Second one scatters. Clipping just the one, so that one guy set on fire several times over. So one's on fire. Needs to get a couple more on fire and hope that the fire doesn't go out next turn. That would net him the one point he needs if he can clear out the rest well, of those models. At the moment, Tristan's still alive. So that means that Redeemer can definitely get into position it needs. Martin considering here. Well, Xerxes going next. Xerxes puts Defender's Ward back on Tiberian. It's interesting. Force the purification, I suppose, if you really want to get rid of him. Xerxes moving back. And he press forwards on the Pain Giver Beast Handlers. Interesting. Giving them an extra two inches. So we see those. Gets them into position to boost up Tiberian next turn. Half expecting that we'll see at least one whip attack against uh, an errant. Nope, not going to happen. Doesn't quite have the distance. We see a condition from Tiberian. The Gladiator being the last model, I believe, that Martin has to activate. Does double down towards the uh, flag where those zealots are. So, so fire rolls. Start off Mike's turn with rolling for fire. Doesn't go out. Martyrdom's the fire roll on the errant. That errant who's protecting the Reckoner by position. The Redeemer does suffer a little bit of fire damage here, potentially. Three points. But since he was in perfect shape earlier, it isn't really going to have a big impact on this turn anyway. Mike notes that he wants to be sure that he allocates this time. Passes out a lot of focus here to the Harbinger's Reckoner. Tristan gives some to his Reckoner. Redeemer. Redeemer. Yep. <laughs> Let's go with Redeemer. <laughs> I'm sure Mike wishes they were Reckoners at this point. Yeah, if they were all Reckoners, that would be a pretty good deal. So, yes. Uh, looks like three to the Harbinger's Reckoner. <laughs> oh, wow. I just did it again. Three to the Harbinger's Redeemer. Two or three to Tristan's Redeemer. Mike's still thinking about his other focus allocation. He's got plenty of souls on the Reclaimer to be able to give the uh, Reckoner its full up. Yeah, or potentially the Redeemer. Depends on how else he wants his focus to use, really. So it looks like Tristan just has one, which means Tristan's Redeemer has three in its stack. So Mike going all in on Tiberian. So Harbinger activates first. She advances, gets herself out of the kill box, uses the purification spell, heals four of the damage that's on her and goes Back to having seven damage points on her, so ten remaining yet again. Advances with the Reclaimer. Reclaimer. Mm -hmm. Gives three focus points to the Reckoner using Communion. Cataphract Archuary are there in the middle. Tyrant Vorkesh leading his unit of shield-walled Citrati over there. Choir activates. 
advances, goes into the woods a little bit for some concealment. Now that the spare choir has given their life for the cause, this <laughs> choir needs to be kept in good shape. See them positioning around. So Ready now, to. each of them is going to choose one jack to him of battle. So, battle everywhere. The Redeemer standing still and aiming and shooting. Needs a seven and misses. So the one three inches. Not ideal. Drifts long. Clips one guy, but does, does not no deal damage. any damage. Boost the hit this time. Wants Needing to a seven. make sure to get at least one sky hammer where he wants it. Boost the damage roll. Try and clear out that trooper. But four points. Good old shield wall. So it does hit. Wow. Wow. The deviate or the AOE damage deals five points to the incendiary. And blast there does nothing. And Pain Giver goes down. That's important. The Beast Handlers like the choir, dwindling quickly. Let's see Mike. Rackner activates, sacrifices movement to stand up, swings on Tiberian. Right. So it does hit. Can expect to see him using a whole bunch of attacks here. Three points to the one. Does hit even on the three. Thanks to the hymn of battle. Does hit. So Tiberian is on fire. And does three more points to the six. So Tiberian has 10 points left. So that was not bad. Does hit. Needs a big roll here. Not enough. So Nicaea trying to finish the job here. Uses acrobatics to avoid any free strikes here. Does Swings. Hit. And dice off four a lot. dice, but a lot Nothing. off. So did two. So three points total because she's in his back with no shield. Second Rapid attack. strike attack also hits and deals one oh. more point, leaving Tiberian with just two oh. damage circles. Can the errant leader maybe do it? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. The errant's in the front. It's just too much off. Wow. So Tristan's Redeemer aims. No him of battle starts, on this uh, one, though. Taking some shots. No him of battle. Right, so low accuracy and doesn't have the damage boost. Even with the aim, hit. it's a equivalent of a three rat. Does tag its target. So two boxes left on the initial target. Blast damage on the others. So nothing on blast. Buys a second attack. And misses. Six three inches. Going to clip some cataphracts to Trotty. So we'll see a check going on. <coughs> so nothing happens. Drifts right in the center of all those models. So Redeemer not contesting the flag, though. Nope. Didn't move.
So we've got Tristan swinging on the damage to Trotty. Tristan is not a Satrati killer. No. I mean, the boosting from the focus. And the boosting's always good. The charge. Did but if fair? he could get an Incendiary in his sights instead. That would be better. Or an Arcuary. So misses. And misses again. So Tristan whiffing uh, six out of seven attacks. It's crazy. <laughs> See Holt and Ayana. Activating. Ayana and Holt do seem to be contesting the flag, I think. Looks like Ayana's in there. Holt moves three. Three more. Finish their advance. So we see Kiss Use of Willis. Kiss of Willis one more time. Does hit. Pow 14s from Holt's pistols. So same guy again, does hit, does a bit more and damage. And eliminates him. that incendiary. So Mike trying to figure out where uh, different units are. He's got a couple things left to activate. So Choir takes a free strike. And that and dies. choir member's eliminated. He's got the zealots left. Yeah, the holy zealots are still to go. And that, that exemplar errant.